All right, guys. Infinite Warfare just dropped, or the trailer at least. Uh, we just got our first look at what it's going to be, and uh, really, I guess it expands on a lot of what Call of Duty has done in the past two to three years here. Uh, we've seen that they've gone from not just Modern Warfare, where it was just combat, ground combat, we're now seeing them go to even sci-fi levels. Um, it looks like it's going into sort of dead space territory, where we're going to have some sci-fi dogfighting in space, uh, we're going to have some sci some in-space missions. Um, it's going to be very fascinating, because this does not look like the same, call this definitely doesn't look like the same Call of Duty from uh, previous years. This looks like a Call of Duty from, uh, that really uh, relies on Knowing what Advanced Warfare was, knowing what Black Ops 3 was going for, and now going into Infinite Warfare. I can't really tell if this is going to be a continuation of Advanced Warfare or not. It seems as if it will be, but Infinite Warfare looks very promising. Um, I can't wait to see what it'll turn out to be. But overall, I don't know if I'm going to actually purchase this. It looks like a very cool title, but um, it just looks like more of the same. What I was really interested in seeing was if uh, we were going to see a, an older Call of Duty, a more cl a Call of Duty going back to World War II or World War One fighting, sort of trans trench warfare or some sort of like or uh, storming the beaches, anything like that. I would love to see them go back to that. I guess. Um, I'm just a little worn out on the sort of sci-fi, super Call of Duty advanced warfare, jump around. Not Maybe I'm just more of a basic Call of Duty guy. I love Modern Warfare 2 and 3 the best. I've played some Medal of Honor games, but, but I don't know. I'm just looking for something to grab about, I guess. It looks very good. If you're into that, it looks very good. I'm into Call of Duty, but I don't know if I'll buy this yet. I'll see what happens at E3. They'll obviously have a reveal. But honestly, it's probably the best time for uh, Medal of Honor to come back. People are looking forward to some sort of uh, really high stakes um, sort of classic warfare. I'd love to see some sort of competition go up against Call of Duty at the end of the year. Maybe it doesn't need to be Battlefield. Maybe it could be Battlefield, but... You know, it's all under the EA wheelhouse. So we'll see what happens, guys. What are your thoughts? Comment below. Thanks for watching. I'm Brian Swan. Stay tuned for more.